Today we will do adaptive components within curtain pattern based families. If you don't want to follow this lesson, I'll leave the link to download the result. Ok, let's begin. First we will create new family. For that I'll go into user interface, recent files. Uh, actually I should close this one. Uh, new family. Uh, metric generic adaptive model open that okay for now on the plan on the 3d um, I'm choosing the dot and I'll put somewhere near the dash line up to you every, you can put this everywhere so and make it adaptive nice mm select one and second uh, select second use this plain line reference line okay for now we're going again to dot line and just put it somewhere on the reference line select one and second other one and make it show reference plans always okay for now we're going to model using the cycle and set the plan and let's create like 60 millimeters it's okay for now uh, go to parameters let's create new one and let's call it R it means radius type 1 Okay, let's make it two inch. No, it's too small. Sixty, I think, will be enough. Sixty. Okay. So, and we will give mm, for this cycle parameter parameter R. Dimension. Go to close. This is dimension and label. We choose the parameter R. Okay. Let's create the two points. Mm, point level reference. Okay, good. Second one point, second point. Make it adaptive. Let's create the spline between them. This is spline reference line and let's put two two lines here let's host it and this one okay let's load profile actually I will I will share the link where you can load this profile. Let's load profile, pipe profile. I will give you a link for download this profile. Choose the profile. After that go to component, pipe profile, set, set our line put here and set other line and put here for now go to the family types create new one let's call it R instance ok let's make it 60 millimeters or 2 inches up to you uh, let's create new one L1 uh, instance reporting parameter for now ok for this line we are using the R oh sorry for this one R and for next one same we are using the R and select both of them this cycle and this one and create the form 
okay uh, second one go to dimension set set the reference line this dot and second dot and let's label L1 okay go to now again to family types um, create new parameter uh, call it use larger size type of parameter yes or no click it ok I forgot it's two instance ok nice mm, and let's write the formula for our radius if use larger size L1 divide by 24 if not L1 divide by 48 not L1 divide by 48 underscore two, two times okay it should be work apply so if uh, our checkbox it's on it's uh, 400 if not it's 200 yet it's working apply let's test it uncheck yes it's small check it's bigger okay okay for this step one more thing let's change the this one to one and this to zero and uncheck the use the larger la larger size okay and now we will save it Test. Let's save it like um, mm, to dot pipe. Let's create one and let it save again. But now it's like three dot pipe. One okay. So mm, select out the pipe and make it dissolve. Choose second dot and just shift it a bit up. Something like this. And create new dot. Uh, don't forget level reference Sorry, somewhere here okay uh, now choose the our second dot and this dot and oh let's let's do this is adaptive first this dot and second dot and spline reference line okay for now choose first dot second dot and last last dot it's a bit harder and let's make this spline leave it like model one okay now we should change position let's let's check first pick a host on this line and make it no it's not good way okay just put some line 
on our model we cannot yet true we can't do that actually this is I'm not sure on which line this yeah now it's on model line let's do here the same just click our profile pick host go to dot number three in the middle and use tab as you see this is our new line this previous this is new and host it now click on this profile model line and this profile and create the form it's not working this this create the form okay let's make it again create yeah we on the way okay for now we should um, create new family um, curtain 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 pattern pattern based this one select the our blue network one half step and our second line we just shift a bit upper and number five on the same distance see this is now equal to second dot and let's do same for first line but just slowly to the under and this one too third one same and fifth here okay okay for now uh, go back to your free pipe load to the project and click one two three and same here one two and three Uh, go to our frame and now we I should have the middle line so how to do that select one point second one and third one use the spline and reference line same here spline reference line okay use dot set it's not okay let's not connect pick Okay, let's create it's the model line set okay so a reference uh, draw on the face and draw on the middle just host somewhere here here and let's do same here and here better if it's if it will be a reference line okay now put it zero 
2 this is 0 8 0 8 mm, to close 0 1 0 9 yeah better same here 0 1 0 9 and select both of them show always same here both always as you see it's a bit rotated so let's fix it minus 15 I think yeah so let's change for everything minus 15 this one and this one minus 15 not angle straight go to reference line set set our plane from the middle to some distance okay same here set plane from the middle to some distance let's repeat here too and, and here now dimension it's a bit large let's make it 1 to 50 dimension okay continue here and here new parameter uh, depth let's make it mm, 750 apply choose all this dimension and create depth now it's same size just put some dot to the end go to create component use our three dot pipe oh actually I forgot one main dot in the middle but it's okay it will be fast set middle one that one here make it depth I think it's gonna be instance 750 yeah line reference set from the center this one here and depth put some dot here and here go to now go to create component one two three let's repeat nice okay for now this line this line and this line show always 
this, 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 this. Show all this. One more step. Select this line and this line and this and make it spline. Oh. This line. This dot. And this dot. Make spline. We get the spline. And let's repeat here. Spline. Okay. Now we should change our distance here to zero. Here to one. Again one. Here zero. Let's put here one dot and here one dot. Yeah, let's again here and here, here and here. This dot and this dot. This is zero point one. Yes. This is zero point four. No, actually it's so much. 0 0.3 0 0.3 This and this is 0 0.9 This and this is 0 0.7 mm. Looks not good 0 0.2 0 0.8 perfect um, did you remember our two dot pipe so we should uh, load it now go to um, insert load the family family two dot pipe create component two dot pipe and let's connect it from this dot to this from this to this from this to this and let's repeat for all of them We need one more dot. This is its uh, 0 0.2, so let's create here. This is will be also 0 0.2. Uh, go to component and let's create like this. Point. 0.2 component here to here and let's change this one and this one to 
zero point twenty five. Yes, and this one, this one, zero point sixty five. Let's put here same. One point, second point. This is zero point eight. Zero point eight component here here okay now we should do some trusses between of them how to do that actually this is same go to create component choose our dot by dot from the middle to middle from this one to this one and last one from this to here 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 okay one last thing from this line to this line create spline actually select like this spline reference same here from 1 to 3 spline reference and put some dot on the middle this is dot will be 0 0.5 again component from here to here from here here and from the middle to here Let's repeat here same from that line to that line. Create the spline from that to that spline. Don't forget make it a reference line. Put some dot here and here. Zero point five create component here to here and from middle to the middle and one, one more last one, this one, this one spline and from number 6 to number 1 spline put some dot to the middle 0 0.5 create component from down to up from up to down in the middle go to hide lines so one more thing and we are done just uh, choose our mm, line select entire the project and check larger Let's make it only for the middle one. Only for the middle. Yes. So our trust system is finished. Now you can mm, create new family actually let's yeah let's create new conceptual mass 
just go to north view create some spline let's do like this go to 3d choose this line create the form let's extend it a bit now choose that one divide to surface uh, one and a half make it uh, over hanging mm, let's create a bit realistic 20 20 go back to our family load to the project select that one and use our family just uh, wait a couple of minutes yeah here we are our trust system it's finished